25 year old female teacher found lifeless at her home facing down in Clarendon. Also, two females just get caught up down a mobile. Pierre can't them get one of them fatal in a reprisal. You understand me? I say also Dana Lee mother send a serious message to Noel Maitland and she wants to know which part her daughter they she need her daughter either lifeless or alive my people female security guard found lifeless my viewers and my subscribers you don't want to miss this my viewers and my subscribers but before we get into all of this i would appreciate if you all would leave a like on this video please give this video a thumbs up get it to at least a thousand likes my people you understand also if you're a new viewer as a first time on my channel then please subscribe to my channel and turn on the post notification bell so whenever we drop new content you will be first to be notified share the content and leave your opinion down below in the comment section we're soon forward yo dance all royalty review tv drop the bad review them no man you know see you always drop the bad review them you know people remember to subscribe and like people remember to subscribe and like so welcome back to my viewers and my subscribers them we are going to start this morning report with a story about a female that went missing on Sunday, a security guard. Body of missing female security guard found in Westmoreland. The body of a woman who was reported missing on Sunday was found in her community in Savlanamar, Westmoreland on Monday afternoon. The deceased has since been identified as 33-year-old Cheryl McDonald, a security guard of Grato District in the parish. McDonald's body was found in bushes, with the left side of her face disfigured. It appears to have been eaten by animals. According to the police, residents stumbled upon the body in bushes about 1 p.m. McDonald was reported missing on the weekend after she failed to return home from her place of employment in St. James. Reports from the police are that McDonald was last spoken to via cellular phone by a relative on Saturday where she indicated that she was traveling from Savlanamar to Montego Bay on a public transportation. Investigations are ongoing. There is still no cause of death as yet, people. So, it's a sad situation and I just want to say my condolences go to the family and relative and co-worker, the loved ones of Miss McDonald. You understand me? I say because you know it's never nice to lose a loved one. But my people, let me know what you thought down below in the comment section. And as usual, remember to leave a like on this video. Alright? Like we move on to the next topic. So this incident happened not too long ago, down at St. James, down at Montego Bay down at the crime parish two women have been fatally can up them get a portion to can one fatal in york bush mount Carey, st james the victims are reportedly relative of a man who is being sought by the police for a double loss of life of a cooking gas seller and a cabinet maker in the same community about two months ago an early post had reported two deaths However, the police say only one death has been confirmed so far. Cha -cha. So that is a reprisal shooting me people. You understand me? I say that is a reprisal for a man where um take the life of a cabinet maker and a cooking gas seller. You understand me? I say, and that is why you see when you go do certain things, you have to think about your relative. We are going left behind. You have to think about your relative where people are going to attack. You understand me? I say, you can't think for yourself alone. You cannot think about yourself alone. And what please you, you have to think about your relative. What you are going left behind, brother? See what you do? You allegedly do the crime. Take out two people. And now the man them can do a reprisal upon your family. And that is why the crime continues going on because this family now. Go back and go do an next reprisal and then that family now come back and then the war just continue and it continue. You understand me? I say the violence now work out. On have to think about on a family member. On have to think about on a relative. On have to think about on a kids if you don't even get none. On have to think about the after effect, what they go take them. 
You understand me? I say because enough people where you say lose them three points, them never do nothing. But them relative do things, and then man come clap them way. You understand? It not pretty. So on a think about on a relative before on a do the crime. You understand? Simple that. But let me know what you thought down below in the comment section, with people. We're moving on. So we are going to take a traffic over there in a Clarendon, one of the most crime parish. We always make the news. Them always make the news. You understand? Where a 25-year-old teacher found lifeless, lying down, face down on the ground in Clarendon. You understand? The police, the Clarendon police are investigating the last life of a teacher whose body was found outside her home in Artwell Garden, Maypen, in the parish on Monday night. The deceased has been identified as 25-year-old Vanessa Williams. Police reports are that Williams returned from work on Monday afternoon, but several calls to her cell phone went unanswered. Her body was later discovered on the ground in her yard about 10.49 p.m. The police say the circumstances surrounding Williams' death are unknown at this time but investigation are ongoing so a teacher lose her three points them don't know if it was natural cause or somebody took her three points from her but for now investigation are ongoing so we definitely are going to keep on a posted upon this one so we definitely need to subscribe so as soon as we get some update and this one we can just bring it forward to one of my people so remember to subscribe and turn on the bell for new content you understand what i say and for updates and remember to like the video so we are going to move on to our next topic you know so you know say we are covered the Donald e. Donaldson story from the start and we are always going to any little update we get so now we are going to bring on an update from miss sophia log that's Donald's mother all right and it go like this. Almighty God of Daniel, where is my baby girl? With a lot of crying emoji. Dana, my lover, today make five months since I hear your voice on the phone telling me you will soon be home to be my friend with a lot of crying emoji again. You never return home, my love. Where are you? With question mark and a lot of crying emoji. Five long restless months since you wake up out of my bed to be with that savage. Now nobody is willing to talk what really happened to my baby girl. Lord, please give me strength with a lot of crying emoji. Cha cha. People on the knee send out the prayers for Miss Sophia Log. Because she still a fight to put the pieces together. You understand me? I say and we all know it's never nice to lose a loved one, especially if you lose your own blood, your daughter, where you want to share the same bed, the same meal. Every time we see Miss Sophia Log post, it really tear my heart apart for no say this woman lose her daughter after this brother allegedly got took the woman's daughter out her bed. Now, they can't give the woman an account what them do with our daughter not even as much if you say all right then give her about the body so she can have a closure to this thing this woman have to sit down a cry and a pray to god every day and a wonder in her head which part are done lady which part are daughter day you understand me i say that is wicked that is heartless brother at least give back the woman the body of her daughter so she can go bury it and if you want to bury it already tell her which part you want to do it so she can go dig up the bones and get a proper burial she can go get a proper burial she can have a closure to it then can do some sample and find out say yes the remain of Donald Lee Donaldson and then can get a proper send off you understand what I say but if this woman can get a closure to our daughter we're about it a go forever aunt her it a go forever aunt her and she never ever they go stop cry and worry about this trust me but only god knows what best and 
we need to remember this God not sleep I guess the wicked things them where people don't feel like say God not see what they might do then God definitely I see what they might do because God they above every man you hear? so on the need to give this woman in data remain so she can go get a proper send off your daughter and get a closure to this thing that's all me have to say the people if you don't want to see justice for Danali, you want to leave a like on this video and type justice for Danali Danielson type justice for Danali Danielson and like the video if you don't want to see justice for Danali Danielson all right until then people i'm out this is the next video dance our reality review i say big up to all of my supporters them both people who just Subscribe to my channel and my loyal viewers and subscribers. Then big up on yourself. Enough love, enough respect, heart of love.